From the indoors to outside, BSU football has dominated on defense in the Brent Bolte era. The Gang Green wasn't just one of the best in the NSIC last season, but also put up impressive numbers nationally. They do return some key pieces in that secondary, but front seven-wise, you're going to see a lot of new faces in 2018. The D-line and linebacking cores, senior heavy, so that makes some fun position battles for new D.C. Jamie Bish. For us, it's going to be just a lot of consistency is what we're looking for uh, from the young guys. You know, we've got inside linebackers who haven't taken a whole lot of reps with the exception of, of one of those guys, that's Andre Chisley. Uh, and up front, you know, um, you know, we have a lot of new faces. Uh, we got a, our Sam linebacker. Uh, he's taking a number of reps, Gabe Ames, but uh, he's just a redshirt freshman, so he, you know, he needs the reps. All of our guys need the reps, uh, and we're looking for consistency from the whole group there. And, and uh, some position battles are definitely happening uh, at linebacker and on the D-line, without question, every day. Good news, the green and white spring game is back on. Just push back a day to Sunday. Action will kick off around 2.30 in the afternoon. All that at Chet Anderson Stadium. If you enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland PBS.